Hey guys, so I have another haul video for you. Um, I was really, really excited because I woke up this morning and Bed Bath & Beyond always sends me flyers. And what I love about them is they send you like a coupon. And it's $5 off of your purchase of $15 or more. So that's really good. So you're basically getting like a free product. So I always do that. So if you purchase $15 minus 5 bucks you're only going to spend $10 and you get like a free item. And Ulta also had a little sale going on, so they sent me a coupon. And that one is actually a better deal because um, Bed Bath & Beyond, you have to spend 15 to get that 5 bucks off. But Ulta is $3.50 off $10. So that's really good. Like, that's really, really cheap. Okay, so I also went to Target, picked up a couple things. Um... I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and Target. Yeah, I went to Target and I also went to Sephora to pick up a few Clinique things. I also got a Clinique foundation. Okay, so let's just get started. So from e.l.f., I just got a, a whole bunch of backups that I've been loving. And I'm also going to give these out as prizes for my giveaway. So, yeah. So I got another one of their Heavy Glow Bronzing Powders. And this one is in Warm Tan. I really love this. It's like a shimmery highlight powder thing. So these are gonna these are for prizes. Um a shimmering facial whip. This is like a liquid highlighter and this one is in lilac petal. It's like a beigey highlighter. It's very shimmery. And um an all over color stick in golden peach, which is like a nice peachy glowy color. Just look like that. And this is like, um, a, what is that? A thick cream blush kind of thing. Okay, so I also got one of their two-in-one condition glosses. And this one's like in a purpley plum color, which was really unique. I really, I have some on my lips right now. So, I don't know if you see that. But it's really unique. I've never seen any colors like this. So, and this one's called Plumtastic. And it's really, really conditioning to it. And it gives your lips just a beautiful, healthy-looking glow, a beautiful-looking shine. It's really sheer. But underneath that, I have some lipstick on, so. Okay, so I'm not going to talk too much about this product, but you guys know I'm, this is my number one all-time favorite brush right now. I picked up another one, and I'm not going to talk too much about this. So I have a separate, complete review video on this, the e.l.f. Studio Line brush. And this is a flat top, flat top powder brush. And all I could say is this is the best, 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 best brush I've ever had or owned. And it's so soft. The bristles are amazing. It's like, oh my gosh, it feels so good when you put it on your face. But I really love this. This was like three bucks. So the, the first one I bought, I used for my liquid foundation. But I don't want to have to keep, you know, cleaning it off in between my makeup, you know, applications. Um, so... I bought another one specifically for my powder, so I just it's kind of dirty. Okay, so I really love this. It's so multi-purpose. This is the only brush that I use, well, except the first one I bought. So I use this for everything on my face. Powder, contouring, blush, foundation, everything. Okay, so I also picked up one of their Revlon Color Stay um, Retractable Eyeliners. And this one's in black, and I have another one, but it just kind of goes up like that. But I bought another one for my purse because I absolutely love this. It's waterproof, and this eyeliner is no joke. I have it on right now. It really does not smudge or smear or flake off. It's waterproof, and and you know what? That's that's not true. It does not last just 8 to 12 hours. It lasts me all day. I usually have watery eyes, so I love this. I, Revlon's Colorstay line has the best items ever especially their foundations and just all of it basically all the color stay Revlon things okay okay guys so I also picked up a Revlon um, cream eyeshadow quad and I use this as bases and it has like these white um, whitish light colors and I use this as a base under my powder eyeshadows to make it more vibrant, to give it a pop. 
and it has like a kind of like a on camera it looks really light, but it's like a plummy purpley bluish color. So this is gonna be good for like with the eyes and stuff. Okay, and I also picked up um I've seen this in a magazine and I always wanted to try it out. I think it looks so cool. I also a lot of people also rave about this on YouTube. So I've seen really nice reviews. So this is the Physician's Formula Concealer Set. And I'm pretty sure you guys seen this. And it's a correcting concealer set. And it's really I really love the packaging. So it just comes in this box. And it's really good for just traveling. Because you could bring it with you. So it's very tiny. And it comes with the first step, second, and third. And the first one is like a green color which is like for redness and stuff like that the cancel out redness and this one's to cover the concealer and the pink one is for highlight it's like a liquid highlight highlight color so and what I love about this it's really small and just kind of has like a wand kind of thing like that and I love how you can just snap it off like that so if you don't want to bring all three with you you could just pop it back in and just bring this one, or you could just bring the concealer one, which is what I'm pretty sure we're all going to be bringing. So I really like this, can't wait to try it out. So most of these I haven't tried out yet because I just got it. So I also picked up, um, where is it? Okay, so I also picked up... Some things from the beauty supply store. So I bought um, this hair tinting set because um, my friend's gonna, me and my friend are probably gonna help each other do highlights on each other's head. So I found this little tin, um, highlighting kit which comes with like the highlight hat, not the hat, the highlight um, tipping cap, the highlight cap, and it has like the brush and the powder lightener to mix with the color. And I just got a little tiny bucket of clear white gel. And this is like this is like a no brand gel and this was like one dollar, one ninety nine. And I love how it's like a little bucket because I could just scoop it out with my hands instead of like squeezing it from a tube. So yeah, that's what I got from the beauty supply store. And I also went to Sephora and I picked up just a couple of just three or four things. Okay, so I bought the Clinique Super Balanced um there we go. The Super Balanced Liquid Foundation. And this is kind of like a clarifying, I'm sorry, this is kind of like a mattifying foundation. And I used to use this back in the day. I use, I use this for like a bazillion years before I started getting into makeup, before I started using all these other foundations. This was, um, this was my makeup line. Because I used to be so afraid to use other things on my face because I... Um, I don't know, ever since I, ever since I tried using the MAC foundations, I think those are select, um, studio, select, I don't know, the liquid foundation in the glass container. Ever since I started using that, I just, um, when I first used it, it broke me out, um, I got really itchy, it just totally ruined my skin, and I was so scared to give other foundations a try, so I just, yeah. Clinique. I was so scared to try other makeup lines, but I just specifically stayed with Clinique and for like years, like throughout my high school years, and I was just afraid to try their things because I was afraid. I was afraid I was gonna, you know, I was afraid I was gonna be allergic to it and if it was gonna, you know, I don't know, break me out because my skin was so sensitive. So I don't know, I kind of went back to it because, I don't know, I kind of miss using it and I really love this. It's kind of pricey too, it's like 20 something bucks I think. But it's called Super Balance and um, it absorbs oil where oil control is needed. So it keeps your face balanced and it also moisturizes where hydration is needed and it's oil free. So this is really good because it's really mattifying. And I also got a lipstick from them in... Blush, what is this? Blush Nude, which is just like a kind of dark mauve pinky color. So, this is from Clinique. 
And I also picked up a lipstick from Lancome, so, which I actually have on right now. And over that, I have on some of the e.l.f. Plumtastic gloss. That's why it kind of looks a little purple. And this is just like a, this is really nice for spring. It's kind of like a mauve berry color. I have some on my lips right now. So, it's really, it's really nice. It's a dark color, but it's not too dark, which I love. Okay, guys, so let's just move on. Um, so then I went to Bed Bath & Beyond. And I got one of their Dua Waterproof Lash Glue. This is, like, the best lash glue I've ever, ever tried. I love this. Um, I'm not using other ones. This is the only one I'm going to be using because it's just perfect. And I also got um, a chapstick lip balm. It's this little container right here, which I'm really loving. It's really moisturizing, and it's called Ultra Smooth. It's very moisturizing. And I picked up two of their lipsticks, and this is from the... Oh, my gosh. Oh, I thought I ruined it. Okay. So, I picked up two Maybelline lipsticks from their Mineral, I think it's called from the Mineral Power line, I don't know. But I picked up two, and this one is a Nude, which is kind of like a medium pink mauve color. It's really pretty. And I love the packaging, it's really cute. It's like see-through the top. And then the other one is in Healthy Rose, and this one's like a bright fuchsia berry color. So these are really good for spring. This is from Maybelline, too. Okay, so I think that's all I got. Oh, and I also got some nail polishes from Bed Bath & Beyond. So, um, I basically got three. So I got two NYC nail polishes, and this one is kind of like a turquoise, aqua green kind of color. It's really good for spring. And kind of like a magenta, like a magenta fuchsia color. And I, this is the one I have on right now, this one right here, which is the Maybelline Wet Shine Diamonds. And it's like a shiny nail color. It has like little glitters and shimmers on it. And that's why it's called Wet Shine. So it looks really wet. It's really, really pretty. And this is, this is like a bright fuchsia color. Okay. And that's pretty much it, all I got from Bed Bath & Beyond. Okay, so let's move on to Ulta. Okay, so at Ulta, I picked up... Um, I don't have enough time, so let me just do this real quick. So I got one of their Dream Loose um, blushes. And this one is in Heavenly Pink. And I have a whole bunch of these. I really, really love these. And this is from the Maybelline Dream Loose line. So they have like concealers and foundations, but I really love their brush. Blah. Blushes, not brushes. Blushes, because it's so easy to find. It feels so, it kind of feels like whipped cream. It feels so light, and it just gives your face like a nice, sheer, natural looking glow. That's what it looks like. And I got two mineral, ooh, can't pull this. So I also got two blushes from Maybelline. And this is from, oh, sorry. So, see, that's what happens when you're rushing. Okay, so I also got two of the Mineral Power blushes from Maybelline. And these are, like, loose, luminous blushes. They're, like, loose powders. And this one's, like, in a kind of berry color. Like a berry purpley color. And this one's called Fresh Plum, which is really unique, which I've never, like, seen before. And Original Rose, which is, like, a light baby pink color. And I also picked up one of their ne Nexus items. You know, Nexus is really, really expensive. So this was on sale. And this is the Nexus um, Leave-In Conditioner. And this is from Ulta. So this was on sale. Originally, this is like 15 or 16 bucks, And it was on sale for like $9, I think. Plus, I have the coupon off. It's three, three fifty off. And it's just... The Nourishing Botanical Leave-In Conditioner. 
Okay guys, so that's pretty much it, and I'll see you next time. Bye.